Hey, I'd like to welcome you to another episode of Mission Matters. My name is Adam Torres, and if you'd like to apply to be a guest on the show, just head on over to missionmatters.com and click on Become a Guest to Apply. All right, so today I have Joshua Schwadron on the line, and he's founder and CEO of Mighty. Josh, welcome to the show. Thanks so much, Adam. It's a pleasure to be here. All right, Josh. So uh, excited to have you on the show today and then to dive into Mighty and how you're helping your clients succeed. But before we get into that, uh, we'll start this episode the way that we start them all with our Mission Matters Minute. So, Josh, we at Mission Matters, we amplify stories for entrepreneurs, executives, and experts. That's our mission. Josh, what mission matters to you? Yeah, so so we are uh, – in the personal injury space, uh, which, you know, has a bad reputation. And in reality, uh, personal injury helps the most vulnerable uh, when they are most vulnerable. And that mission matters a lot to us because we think that when people are vulnerable, they deserve special protection uh, and they deserve to be picked up. Uh, And the mission um, of, of, of Mighty uh, is to do just that, is to help people uh, when they are most vulnerable uh, get made whole and get back uh, able to move forward with their lives. Great. Um, I love having mission-based entrepreneurs and executives on the line to share, you know, why they do what they do, how they're doing it, and really what we can all learn from that so that we can benefit and grow together. So, again, great having you on. And I guess just to get us kicked off, Josh, so tell us a little bit more about how you got interested in going in this space. Like, what was the idea for Mighty originally? Yeah, so Mighty has actually been in the personal injury space for uh, close to a decade, Um, and uh, for, for most of that time, we've been offering software and services to uh, personal injury law firms and medical providers, financiers in the personal injury industry. And the reason we did that is we've long taken a stance that if we can make the, the players in the personal injury space more efficient, more effective, uh, that, uh, that, that would result in better prices, better services, more transparency for consumers themselves. And so Mighty's always been a very mission-driven company, um, and we've decided, we had decided to attack, uh, helping consumers by actually helping the, the businesses that, that serve them. Uh, we actually changed course, uh, about six months ago. Uh, and six months ago, we launched a consumer service. Uh, that in part competes with our, our old customers, uh, especially personal injury law firms. Um, and Mighty now uh, has a law firm, Mighty Law, uh, that I should note is uh, independently owned and operated, um, but which we're affiliated with. And uh, Mighty Law helps consumers after an accident um, in new and different ways than exist today in the, you know, often uh, – uh, challenging and and perilous personal injury uh, law industry. Hmm. How how is Mighty or and what's Mighty's vision to really to really do things differently? Like give us a little bit of insight there. Yeah, so it starts with incentives. Uh, one of my favorite quotes by Charlie Munger, Warren Buffett's business partner is uh, if you follow the incentives, you'll follow the action. Uh, and what that, what that means is that we are all really bound and, and motivated by our incentives. And most people after an accident, they rely on personal injury lawyers. And personal injury lawyers often tell their clients that their incentives are aligned with their own. Uh, and the truth is that nothing can be uh, further from the truth. Uh, their incentives are actually misaligned with either clients and one of the things that Mighty Law uh, is doing and aims to continue to do more and more is ensure that the right incentive alignment exists. Uh, so Mighty Law has uh, Mighty Law lawyers agree to a code of conduct that is different than what exists in the personal injury world today, and we can go into the specifics of that. Um, but we want to create a more ethical law firm that uh, serves consumers better from the services they get, to the transparency, to the, to the prices they pay uh, law firms. Hmm. 
And so, you know, I don't want to assume that everybody watching this has necessarily worked through a, you know, through through the process of, you know, personal injury or that they've, you know, had had a need for it, right? Um, not unless you, unless something's happening, you may not have. I know myself, I didn't really have, I, you know, I was probably in my late, late 30s before something actually happened to me where I had a need. And before that, I was completely clueless on how anything worked in general with injury. So maybe if you could just spend a minute or two kind of juxtaposing maybe kind of even how the normal industry model works versus what you're doing now, because I just don't want to assume that everybody listening to this understands. Yeah, so th thanks for the opportunity. So. Uh, when someone gets injured, one of the first things uh, they do is they kind of look up and they see the billboards uh, on the highway. Uh, they see the TV commercials that play constantly or the radio ads. And the first and foremost, uh, many of those billboards are, are frankly misleading. Uh, they talk about the million dollar payouts. Uh, they talk about uh, the, the, the fee being free. Um, and mighty uh, has identified that one of the reasons that lawyers often largely exaggerate or, or frankly, outright mislead on those billboards um, is because as soon as you sign on the dotted line with them, you're giving your that attorney somewhere between 33 and 40 percent of the total settlement that you're going to get that moment. And mm -hmm. It incentivizes lawyers to exaggerate their services um, and to, um, you know, take other practices that are bad. So, so mighty law lawyers, uh, first and foremost, have uh, specific advertising rules that they abide by. Uh, they, for example, never talk about the total settlement. They only talk about the, the net settlement that clients get, which is often very different. But in addition, uh, no matter who signs with mighty law, they get 60 days to try out the service and to actually make sure it matches what's being sold to them. Uh, they're able to leave any time without having to pay a money law lawyer anything. Um, and that's because it's really important that people uh, aren't uh, on the hook the moment they're, they buy into a sales pitch. Uh, companies or lawyers especially should be able to, to stand by what they have. Wow. And so what has been, I'm just curious, you know, obviously I understand the software side that you mentioned, but this part, I mean, this is breaking news. The last six months or so, you meant, as you mentioned, that you've launched this side of things. Um, like, what's been the response so far? Yeah, so in addition to doing things like I just mentioned, we also uh, have, uh, Money Law has far lower fees uh, than the industry standard rates, and the services that that are provided um, are are actually well. Sounds are like actually, the response has been good, then, right? I gotta pay less. Well, I get more than. <laughs> yeah. Ahead. Well, so, so so what's been most interesting is the response from the personal injury industry oh, um, yeah. has has been absolutely wild. We have been attacked left and right. Mm -hmm. We've had we've we've had lawyers um, all over social media bashing us. Uh, we've been reported to state bars, even though we've done obviously nothing wrong. Uh, we had um, the, 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 we were threatened um, with a lawsuit by the largest personal injury law firm. And my funniest is we were actually going to put a billboard up ourselves, which helped educate people about how billboard lawyers are often misleading their clients. And the billboard companies uh, wouldn't allow us to actually go through with the ad because they said it violated their terms, even though it didn't. All it did was actually try and compete with their biggest customers. So the, the, the pushback from the PI industry, uh, which some people have called a cartel, uh, have been pretty, pretty uh, scary to witness firsthand. Mm. Um, on the other hand, the reaction from consumers has been overwhelmingly positive. Uh, I think people like the fact that we're less expensive. They like the fact that we're more holistic. They like the fact that we're more transparent. And they like the fact that they can actually come and try the service uh, get free legal services without actually having to uh, commit, and they can see what they're actually going to get instead of having to sign a third of their case over on the dotted line on day one. Mm. 
So what are your, I mean, tell, talk about plans for expansion and really just what's next for Mighty. Obviously, you're, to say it's an industry disruptor might be, a, it's definitely accurate or maybe an understatement. I'll be interested to continue to follow this, to follow this story. But what, what's next? I mean, like, what, what, tell us about plans for uh, scaling and bringing this to more people. Yeah, so um, Mighty is, uh, you know, already in 10 states. Uh, we are um, going to be expanding to all 50 in the coming uh, months and years. Um, in addition, you know, most personal injury law firms haven't changed their service or their pricing in decades. Mm -hmm. And even though Mighty is already uh, an industry leader in both, uh, frankly, all we want to do is get better and better. We want more services for less money. Um, and tr trying to create uh, a service that constantly improves uh, is, is, is actually what all businesses ought to be doing. Mm -hmm. But the personal injury industry is broken. And uh, it for too long has been stayed and has been unable to actually evolve. Um, and so we're excited to continue challenging ourselves to get better and better, uh, e even though we think that we're already best in class. Wow. It's, that's a great story and um, and one that I'm I'm glad to bring to my audience. I mean, I just love um, bringing disruptors on here, whether it's an industry or otherwise. Here, a lot of a lot of innovation going on in healthcare, tech, other things like this. And and then when I when I see what you're doing over at Mighty, I mean, it's a great story. And I and I, I agree with you. Like, I mean, I've seen the um, the overall you know personal injury injury um, industry hasn't changed in a long time. And I sometimes I sit back and I. I look at some of these fields that I'm like, like somebody's got to cover there. Somebody's going to do something. Um, I've seen a lot of that happen to me with escrow, with just all these other different things, industries that are um, that are all different areas. But this is interesting to see what what happens with Mighty, and I'm glad to bring you on the show and to hear about this early on, so that as I see this grow and when Mighty becomes a household name, I'll be like, oh, I remember I had Josh on the show back in the day. Oh, that's, great. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. Um, so that being said, Josh, um, if somebody if somebody's watching this or listening to this and they want to learn more about Mighty and to connect with your team overall, I mean, what, what's the best way for them to do that? So uh, we have a we have a great domain name. Uh, it's just Mighty.com, M-I-G-H-T-Y.com. Uh, there's a there's a form, there's a phone number. People can fill out the form. They can call us. Uh, we have a team that's standing by that can get back to them uh, really quickly, and we'd be super excited to chat with them. That's awesome. We'll put we'll put all that information uh, into the show notes, the websites, and all that other good stuff, so that the our audience can just click on the link and head right on over. And uh, speaking of our, the audience, uh, if this is your first time tuning into a Mission Matters episode or or um, listening to the content. We're all about bringing on business owners, entrepreneurs, and executives and having them share their mission, the reason behind their mission and their model, and really what they're doing to provide value out there in the marketplace. Uh, if that's the type of content that sounds interesting or fun or exciting to you, hit that subscribe button because we have many more mission-based individuals coming up on the line, and we don't want you to miss a thing. And Josh, again, thank you for coming on the show and uh, wishing you much more continued success. So thank you. Thanks so much, Adam. It was a pleasure. All right, Josh. So we'll cut the audio there. Man, what a great story. This is good. Thanks uh, so much. Yeah, I think it's yeah, I, we're, 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 Do you actually hire a personal injury lawyer yourself? Yeah, yeah. You know, I, I had. Um, I was a couple years ago. Oh, I would have. Like I, I would have. Something like that. Mm -hmm. Oh, I would have loved to get into that, you know, hearing about your experience and trying to, like, juxtapose it against, um, you know, what maybe could have happened or should have happened. Um, maybe yeah. you will have the opportunity to know the time. Yeah, no, um, definitely, and uh, just in general, I, I mean, I, I love the model, I love what you're about, and, and I'm happy to bring this to my audience. We're going to, um, in terms of timeline, just so you know, obviously this is recorded, this is all going to be edited and all that good stuff, and so this should be live within the next 10 business days. Um, when it does go live, you'll get an email from one of my assistants, either Diana, Julius, or Kate, and it'll have obviously all your content, all the other good stuff on there that they put, and then I know we have a couple of your um, uh, team mates on there as well. I think Charlotte at Mighty.com will make sure she sees it along with Oscar Hamilton. And uh, really, if you need anything else, we're, we're here. I'm available if you need anything, okay? All right, awesome. Thanks so much. Great. Thanks so much for the opportunity, Alan. Thank you. Bye-bye. Take care. Bye-bye.